Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Hope you are okay on that side of the screen. And today with a simple device which will make in most of cases our life Easier. This is the Ore Matrix Switcher 4K 60Hz with a lot of features but before we talk about some of them let me show you how exactly does it work. We've got three sources right over here. I've got a mini PC which is at this screen at this moment. I've got an Apple TV and an Nvidia Shield. The Apple TV is connected to, well they all are connected to the Ore. I've got one, two, three inputs. One of them is free right over here and then I've got one, two outputs. This one will go to this TV. This one will go to that TV right over there. I can change through these buttons and I can change through the remote. In terms of powering the unit, there is a transformer included or a power adapter, but I'm not using the power adapter. I'm using a cable, micro USB to this mini computer right over here. I could be using with the Nvidia Shield any USB will be enough to power this device, so it's less one power adapter. Now, what I can do is just control this PC normally right over here and at this moment I've got the Apple TV so I could just select and use it right over here. Now the advantage is that I can select to uh, change with this button. If I want to go to number three for example, the source number three which is the Apple TV so I will have replicated right over here and as you can see when we change to a source that it's already being used there will be a pause on both screens so just have that in mind. Now if I move to number four right over here which is the Nvidia Shield it will um, have the same behavior on the screen that was being used but at this moment I've got Nvidia Shield on one TV right over here and I've got still the Apple TV right over here on that screen. Now one of the things that I would like to show as well is that if I change this one to the mini PC which is at number two and I'm going to select on the remote control um, it will not flicker this screen because the source is not being used. So this is just something that happens when the source is being used. So right over here when we select A or B what happens is go, it will go from 1, 2, 3, 4. So if I want to move from 2 to 1 I will need to go 2, 3 and 1. Um, right over here we have the advantage that we can select from 2 to 3 or 3 to 2 at this moment I selected 3 which is the one being used right over here which is the Apple TV so it did flicker the screen and if I go from here to 2 for example it will flicker the screen once again because it was being used but at this moment I've got the mini PC right over here I've got the Apple TV right over there if I select number 4 here it will go to the Nvidia Shield and as you can see it did not flicker the screen so no interruption at all and this is it this is the way that it works I can uh, have two different sources with all the specifications that we have seen without any issues whatsoever in a very easy manner and I did enjoy the fact that I can power without the power adapter just by plugging in a USB to the mini computer in this particular case. And now that you have seen how it works it's really easy. Now I had it in front of the TV but if I was using this in a real life situation I would um, probably most definitely to put it underneath TV stands or something like that to hide all the cables but the point is that it works really nice. It has four inputs, two outputs and uh, it has one of the outputs which is the one that I like a little bit less on the front but once we get a place that it will hide then the cable will not be notable. Now the biggest advantage of this matrix switcher instead of some splitters that we have seen is that it maintains the pass-through of a lot of stuff. I will put here on screen so that I don't forget any but this is the biggest advantage. There are a lot of splitters but most of them will lose some signal, will lose some audio details that we have and for example the arc feature that this one has most of them don't have. So this is the biggest advantage. I will leave a link down below just in case you are looking for a solution such as this for your setup. If the video was helpful don't forget to leave that thumbs up right over there which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. My name is Roberto George today with the Ore Matrix Switcher and as always I'll see you guys on the next one.